But it looks like Lori Laughlin's uh, nightmares may turn into reality because she faced up to 45 years in prison. Wow. Mm. This is about the college entrance scandal. Yes, the college yes. admission yes. scandal. 45 years? Trying to get her daughters into school. Now, according to reports, yeah, she hired a prison consultant to prepare for her life behind bars. Uh, and allegedly teach her martial arts. Is this special, really? <laughs> yeah, I know, I know. It's 45 years, how long it would take to pay off college if you paid for it? <laughs> That's why she's getting 45 years for that. Exactly. A prison consultant. I have so many questions here. So Me many too. questions. First of all, does the prison consultant have a teardrop <laughs> on his face? And how many? And right. second of all, is the prison consultant or have they ever been to prison? Right. And third of all, um, has this prison consultant cook crack with Freeway Ricky Ross? <laughs> or has this prison consultant been cooking pot roast with Martha Stewart? I, I need answers, yeah. Which way? Which I need way? answers. Which one is it? Which one is it? Way. Okay, so now here's, this is what a source told reporters. The advisor is there to help her learn the ropes. That's not to be construed with she thinks she's going to lose her case. Jeez. She's just a planner. I don't mean to uh, surprise, shock, and totally disappoint you white people. <laughs> yeah. And I don't mean to spread a stereotypical thing that black people know more about jail. Yeah. But there's absolutely no way to prepare to be safe behind right, the bars. Right, right. Yeah. Yeah. right. I always thought that if I was there, I would just go there, head down, do what, and that. But then I'd get that girl who's like, "Oh, you can't look at us. Right, right, <laughs> too right. good, to, too good to say hello." And then you're like, "No, no, I." Heidi's got an eight-inch tongue. She's getting traded for cigarettes. <laughs> yeah. she, Heidi's getting traded for ramen noodles and a pack of cigarettes. I'd eat well, but I'd also eat well. <laughs>